Did you know that World War II was not just about guns and bombs, but also about mind games and unusual strategies? Here's a fascinating look at how the necessities of war can lead to the most extraordinary of tactics. Picture this, Germany, in the throes of World War II, and coffee, that much-loved beverage, is nowhere to be found in major cities. Why? Well, the supply lines had been disrupted, making the import of coffee beans practically impossible. But in true German efficiency, they quickly found an alternative, meth-filled chocolate. Yes, you heard that right. Methamphetamine, a potent central nervous system stimulant, was mixed into chocolate to help keep soldiers and civilians alert. It was a strategy born of necessity, but it certainly gives a new meaning to the term strong coffee. But the Germans didn't just adapt their diets. They also devised cunning psychological traps for the enemy. Imagine walking into a room and noticing a picture hanging crooked on the wall. Your instinct to straighten it could have had devastating consequences. The Nazis would booby trap these pictures, turning a simple act of tidying into a potentially lethal mistake. This clever, if insidious, tactic turned the innocuous into the dangerous, keeping their enemies on their toes at all times. So it seems World War II was not just about conventional warfare, but also about psychological tactics and adaptability. The Germans, faced with a lack of resources and the constant threat of invasion, had to think outside the box, and their strategies, while unusual, were a testament to their resilience and ingenuity. This war, like all wars, was a battle of minds, as much as it was a battle of strength, and these strategies show just how far the human mind can stretch when faced with adversity. Stay tuned for more fascinating tales from the annals of World War II, where we'll explore the story of a group of Jewish assassins known as the Avengers and the tale of the youngest soldier in the US Army. You won't want to miss it. Have you ever heard of the Avengers, a team of Jewish assassins, or the youngest US soldier who was only 12 years old? In the aftermath of World War II, a group of Jewish vigilantes took justice into their own hands. They called themselves the Avengers. Not to be mistaken for the Marvel superheroes, this team had a singular mission, to hunt down Nazi war criminals. Their pursuit of justice was relentless, driven by a deep-seated desire to avenge the countless lives lost in the Holocaust. The Avengers' audacious exploits serve as a stark reminder of the lengths people will go to fight for justice when the world around them crumbles. But the war also bore witness to courage from an unlikely source, a child. Meet Calvin Graham, the youngest soldier in the US Army during World War II. At the tender age of 12, Graham traded the comforts of childhood for the harsh realities of war. With a fib about his age and a resolve far beyond his years, he enlisted in the US Army. His deception was so convincing that he was accepted into service and sent off to the front lines. Imagine the courage it took for a boy of 12 to stand shoulder to shoulder with grown men facing the same perils and carrying the same burdens. His secret, however, was revealed after he was wounded in battle. Despite his bravery, Graham was discharged for his misrepresentation of age. Yet his story has been etched in history, a testament to the extraordinary courage displayed by someone so young in the face of grave danger. From a team of Jewish vigilantes hunting Nazi war criminals to a 12-year-old boy fighting on the front lines, World War II is filled with stories of remarkable bravery and resilience. These individuals and groups found their own ways to contribute and fight back, regardless of age or background. In the face of adversity, it's fascinating to see how individuals and groups found ways to fight back and contribute, regardless of their age or background. Ever heard of a soldier who fought for three different armies during World War II? In the thick of the war, a Korean soldier found himself conscripted and compelled to fight not just once, but thrice. Initially serving the Japanese, he was then taken in by the Soviet forces and finally the Nazi German army. His survival each time his squad was defeated on the battlefield is a testament to his resilience. This goes to show the resilience of the human spirit, even in the most challenging circumstances. World War II, a time of conflict and chaos, also brought forth some truly remarkable stories. From the coffee-deprived Germans turning to meth-filled chocolate, to the perilous art of picture straightening, and the relentless pursuit of justice by the Avengers. Let's not forget the young Calvin Graham, who at 12 years old, became the youngest US soldier, and the resilient Korean soldier who fought across three different armies. 
If you enjoyed this video and found these facts intriguing, do like and share it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the bell for new videos. Until next time, keep uncovering history.